all right guys welcome back this is going to be another episode of the weekly gaming fix where we talk about gaming news articles that come out and anything else that's pretty much going on throughout the week now if you are new to the channel if you're new to the series welcome uh give a like subscribe share comment down below uh and let's get right to it so how i already have it up so for this episode we're going to be talking about black panther iron man and um what else what else what else this new call of duty crossover and some games that are coming out for this month and going on so the biggest news that came out of this week we got ea announcing they're going to be doing a black panther and iron man um video game so let's read this and i'm going to give my thoughts so ea and marvel games collaboration will result in a handful of games so this is just two of many with ea motives iron man game and cliffhangers games black panther game now announced and revealed to be in development Neither game technically has a title thus far, and hardly any other inf info is known besides what genre is being used to classify them. It is unknown if all games in this collaboration will be announced soon, but a pattern can already be seen emerging from the characters that EA and Marvel have chosen to feature. Okay. So. EA is making a Black Panther game. EA is making an Iron Man game. Now, EA's track record recently, I'm talking about recently, has been doing pretty good so far. I'm not going to hold you. With this Star Wars game that's came uh, that recently came out, the last Star Wars game, if they can do that and add their finesse to this game, we'll see. We'll see. I'm not... I have my doubts. I'm not 100% all the way in just yet. Um, so I'm a little concerned. We don't know if this is going to be a, a RPG. We don't know if this is going to be an action game, a third person playthrough, first person. We don't even know if this is going to be VR. So they haven't told us anything. We just know that they're making uh, a Black Panther game. So, my ideal version of a Black Panther game would be to copy what Spider-Man's, Insomniac Spider-Man, what they did, add that to Black Panther. Give me all of that. That's, that's all in the jungle too? You can't, you can't ask for nothing more. Uh, but yeah, no, if they can do what they did, not what they did, Insomniac did with Spider-Man, and what EA can do with Black Panther, they just need to do their research. They need to research. They need to find their uh, what what's best for uh, T'Challa. We don't even know if this is gonna be T'Challa. I would hope so, but uh, yeah, we we're gonna see. So let's what else what else what else because yeah like spider-man was pretty much let me not say that batman was pretty much the blueprint for how f superhero games should be and spider-man just took it to a whole another level now if black panther can do that great uh do y'all remember uh the wolverine origins game that came out it, i think it came out in like 2009 or 2008 or something like that that game was amazing uh now i know what marvel i know what superhero games in general in the early 2000s it was ass but they've gotten way better down the line uh and as of recent let's just let's just hope we don't get an avengers game because that game was ass and uh yeah so let, yeah let's ea let's not do that let's not do what square enix did and um y'all will do great now obviously i have my my concerns since black panther is such a uh good character um but hey if it's in uh wakanda if it's in the jungle give me all that 
that's what i want that's what i need so i don't know when this game is going to come out they didn't explain that um they just said it's going to be in, in, be in development that's all uh now they also make an iron man we've also got iron man games back in the day and they was terrible but like i said they just got to do their research they just got to find what best suits iron man no pun intended uh but i'm interested in how iron man is gonna play out though crazy hear me out for all the people who played uh infamous give me that playstyle in iron man that would be dope see i'm giving y'all ideas if y'all don't know but yeah give me give me insomniac playstyle because you know how he like zips throughout the whole city and uses powers and whatnot iron man can do the same thing so we'll see we will see uh yeah because i played i remember i remember playing iron man one on the playstation 2 at the time i was little i thought it was, i thought this game was lit but looking back at it it was complete trash um but yeah i don't know what the other i don't know what the other marvel game is gonna be um but yeah all we know really is black panther and iron man but black panther is like that's the one that's what we need and with with all his powers he can play he can play just like the spider-man fighting style he can play just like that so ea i have faith um like i said all you have to do is do your homework make sure no delays take your time with this game please we don't want another upset like avengers what square enix did i don't know how many times i have to nail that down but yeah we we gotta have a, a good superhero game we've been we've been doing good ever since ever since what when did when did batman come out batman arkham asylum i think it came out in like 2009 or something like that we've been doing good so far so let's not mess it up guardians of the galaxy is another one that's that's a sleeper um yeah if y'all haven't played that that is definitely a that is what avengers couldn't do guardians of the galaxy completely yeah they did what avengers couldn't do so let's hope for the best um i'm not I, I have my doubts but um in time i think that they are gonna come out with a decent game they've been doing pretty good so far ea so now i remember last time the last gen with the ps4 and the xbox uh last gen EA was trash whatever they put out was trash so I think they're coming back from for redemption this is this is a redemption art all right so now we got Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare 2 um, DLC coming through so Call of Duty is gonna be the next Fortnite let me not say that Call of Duty is copying what Fortnite is but in their own way uh, so we got new uh, the boys crossover uh, characters. We got Starlight and we got Homelander coming through, and we have um, uh, oh, what's that character's name? He had the black suit. He's silent. Y'all will get it if y'all seen the show. Uh, but but yeah, um, this is dope. Seeing Starlight uh, and Homelander have a M4. I never would have guessed that. But I saw in the trailers to where they already have their superpowers, so I guess that's like a uh, that's like a perk that they can use uh, in Warzone, I guess. So we we've had DLC characters like um, in the past, like it says here, like we had Rambo, we had Die Hard, Donnie Darko, Attack on Titan, Godzilla vs King Kong, but. I heard that Godzilla vs. King Kong was kind of trash, though. I ain't gonna hold you. But with these characters, uh, it takes a spin. Um, so they're just trying to stay relevant 
at this point. I don't think there's going to be a new uh, Call of Duty this year. And if so, somebody let me know. But I haven't heard anything from Call of Duty or Activision or or what? Treyarch? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, but no, this is this is dope. Uh, I haven't played Call of Duty in a hot minute, but who knows? I might get this because I do like the boys. So, okay, so the crossover shows that, okay, so the crossover adds superpowers to the Battle Royale for a limited time. Upon finding a vial of Tent V, oh, so they add Tent V to this. Players will gain access to one of four superpowers, including a charge jump, electric shockwave, laser vision, and teleport. These powers act as a field upgrades. Okay, so these powers aren't just going to be exclusive to the the um, the boys characters. Everybody can get it. So th this is just adding more add-on content for um, Warzone. But that's dope. Okay, they're going to be using the fuck out of these powers. But no, yeah, that's that's dope. Yeah, Call of Duty is just trying to stay relevant, which isn't a bad thing. It's not because you you know we got the boys coming coming soon. Um, Fortnite has you talk about relevancy. Fortnite has been using every type of media there is, and people still get on that game to this day, and it's still big as ever. So I think that's what Call of Duty is trying to do, but I already it won't be as big as Fortnite. Um, but yeah, it's like second best. So we got some games coming out in July. Um, now for the summertime, it's a drought for video games. It is. Uh, the heavy hitters are gonna be coming through in uh, fall time. We already know this. We got three, four triple a games coming in october and yeah that's gonna be fun okay so let me see if i can find any big hitting game i'm not gonna name off all of these so we got pikmin 4 coming in july 21st so that's gonna be big for the uh for the switch um what else what else what else yeah, pretty much that's gonna be it. Um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, we got Madden NFL uh, 24 coming through in August. Uh, when is that? August 18th. We got the Texas Chainsaw Massacre coming through in August 18th. So, same day. I saw what, I saw what that game looks like. It looked pretty fun. So, I don't know if I'm going to get it. I'm going to just look at people playing it. But it's kind of like a Dead by Daylight. But it sets in the Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie um, world, which is great. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then we're going to roll right into September, fall time. We got Liza Pie. We got Mortal Kombat 1. We got Payday, we got Cyberpunk DLC. So when September hits, I know we're on a drop for this for uh, the month of July, August time, but when September, we we run it. And definitely when October comes, we, we run it. So yeah, that's really all that's been going on throughout this past week. Um, this past week that I can think of really. Uh, but yeah, don't want to hold y'all. I hope y'all have a great Sunday and a great week throughout. And I will see y'all on the next video. Deuces. Never, 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 never.